work. Ross is just driving the hell out of this car. Ross does Car in the wall, Cody Ware. That'll put us under caution in lap 106. Left rear tire's down, I don't know if it was from sliding. I'm looking at the car right now, Cody, if you keep coming. If it doesn't look too bad, we can get some tires on it. Down, down. Looks like he's high-sided it. To the wall. They were hoping to qualify and start three of their four drivers up at the front, but per the rule, pulling out that backup car would make them go all the way to the back for the number 20. Need to get it spun back around. I think he'll get that fire. Plenty of on them and coasted through five, six, and seven, the kind of the hilly and, and curvy parts of the racetrack. Blake Cook, he's on the bottom of the racetrack and everything looks normal. And oh, yeah, you see, it looks like I don't know if it's on the ground or what it was, but there you was saw sparks. something coming out from underneath it. Yep, sparks flying as he went straight up into the wall coming out of turn two. I hope he's okay. That's a big hit. Always oh, driving the car back, but that doesn't mean it doesn't hurt you or affect you. Not only does handling go away, but how does your car? You see the 18. I oh, huge up in the wall. Kyle Busch in the 18, destroying that car. Clearly had a, had a mechanical issue or a tire go down, and clearly that just something happened. It, something happened. Yeah. Uh, right here blew out. That, We heard Kyle Busch talk about yeah. the right rear. I was watching live. They ran. Oh, there they go. Oh, there they go. Hornaday goes around. The right car the can. Almost upside down, and he does go on his hood as Ron Hornaday. There just wasn't any way. Hornaday rolls again in turn number one. You said on the back stretch off turn two. It's Michael McDowell. Heavy contact for McDowell, and he's trying to get the car down to the inside. Lots of flames inside the car. Yeah, he needs to get that car to a stop and get out of it because that see the fire truck coming as quickly as he can get there to get the car pulled over and get out michael but, uh the car hit the wall see he does hit the wall there i don't know if it was a tire maybe ran over something that thing was already Oh, having a good time. Well, Jeff, actually, we have left the Harvick Hotel. Delaney's uh -huh. going to cook some popcorn as we get ready to watch some movies. And hey, we hey, decided hey. to kind of take a little walk around, a little stroll don't here touch. through the motor push uh -oh. Is but that yours? Don't touch that uh -oh. button. Uh -oh. What do we have there, Harvick? Don't touch that button. Toilet paper. We've, don't touch is it. Is it open? We've reached new lows here. Uh-oh. Uh, open uh -oh. sesame. But be sure and take the shoes off because Miss Stevie don't will go kill in us. There. I don't care about Daryl, but Miss Stevie will kill us. Harvick's going to TP that thing. You, you better, better go watch first, out for, for Smitty. Smitty, get Smitty, over there. Smitty, where are you? Smitty is gone. There. Hey, here's <laughs> your roll. Uh, come on inside. Be sure and take the shoes off. All right. <laughs> Unbelievable. Now, where's Steve Burns when you need him? He should be in that one. Burns, get over to my coach quick. Okay, now, I'll start at this end. Oh, for Pete's sake. You gotta what call. A, well, I tell you, you throw it down this way here. You gotta call security, Daryl. Look, oh, we broke it. They broke. Oh, man, do those guys know how to use that? Oh, there we go. oh I can't. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Are we on? Are we still on the air? <laughs> we are. Okay, just for the moment. Uh, look at, oh, look oh at that. man, this is not. Uh, this is killing me. Honey, this is not on tape. Honey, I, I thought I had the door locked, honey. Okay, I don't here know you how go. They got I'm gonna throw it back down to you. The producer from the tick called and he wants his job back. I have nightmares tonight about kids eating free condition changes they were going to and paul menard you see out there in the 21 car next opportunity he has to come to pit road there will actually be a driver changer looking at matt craft and a nascar truck driver taking his helmet off for now but when the stage break comes he will be taking over driving duties for paul menard who is experiencing some neck issues they're lingering neck issues he didn't want to be involved in a wreck here at talladega and decided i'm not attention of leading as much as you can get as many points as you can and they are making this change right now. Paul Menard is going to get out of the 21. Matt Crafton is climbing into it right now. And Rutledge Wood. I try really hard to take care of people, try not to be careless, and I don't like putting up with carelessness, and that just really pissed me off what happened out there. So. Coming out of back straight with his finger out the window and just give me the bird all the way down the straightaway after he'd run me through the fence. So. Uh, I like to take that finger and jam it right up his rear end, I'll tell you that, because he's messing with the wrong guy with that. I mean to win here, not only once, but to win here five times. Well, I don't mean shit right now. Daddy's done one here ten times, so uh, I got to do a little more, but uh, do more winning. But we're going to get there, 
and uh, he was a man. Condition changes that we're going to go through tonight. Daylight, which we're going to take the green flag. I got run over a bug-eyed dummy, I guess. Uh, you know, just pacing still here. That's, that's the 11th time this year I've gotten the hell knocked out of me. It just gets frustrating after a while.